Um, let's talk about some music industry stuff. Okay. Um, so apparently, I'm gonna read off the article. Actually, let's let me pull up the article. So there was a guy who used basically AI and being smart about stuff and like made lots of money. And the he's being indicted on basically uh, fraud, essentially. So it, uh, it says feds indict a uh, musician and landmark massive streaming fraud charges. Uh, he made ten million dollars in royalties from streaming mm. services, basically <laughs> with AI. Yeah, My guy, bro, he was killing it. What did he do? Who's the artist name? So he essentially, said, no, I don't. Not that I know of. Ah, it's not, come on, bro. I read this earlier. Why is it blocking me? Um, he essentially used a bunch of. AI bots to basically uh, make music and then fake, or not fake the streams, but listen to the song. So it obviously incurs listeners, which means you get paid money. And that's illegal? So that's what's crazy about it, because people are like, what law did he really break? Because don't all streaming services basically do the same shit? But when a regular person does it... I feel like artists does it all the time. Bro, bro. <laughs> what, yeah, it, what law is, is he? Not, bro, nothing. I'm going to see if I can put Break it. I suffered a law of bring me my money. <laughs> what, law, what law is he breaking? Uh, here we go. Michael Smith, 52. That's the other thing. This boy, this the guy was 52. So he was with it, bro. North Carolina. Oh, he was smart. smart. He was with it. And this was from 17 to 2024. He came up ten See, mil in seven years, man. You fraud, should be locking him up. Fraudulently did it, but what is the fraud? What part of it is fraud? Um, so he orchestrated a scheme to get around the platform fraud detection systems. Wow, whoop de doo. That sucks for you guys. I um, feel like a company thing more so than a law. Right. So why is it my fault? Your platform sucks or doesn't know how to pick it up. Like it's not my fault. Um, Smith is accused of working with AI music company beginning in 2018 as well as music promoter to generate hundreds of thousands of songs. He bought quantities of email addresses to set up fake accounts and use VPN services disguising um, that he was controlling them from his house. Time out, time out, time out. When you make a Spotify account, it's free. If you want to pay for a premium, then yeah. And you have to. So once again, Give him his money back, bro. Like, I what? Uh, he's gonna make email accounts and <laughs> open up so Spotify's again. He's been charged with money laundering, wire fraud, and conspiracy to commit wire fraud, which is hilarious. Okay, no, I... if he was actually doing the other stuff, okay. But, yeah. like, just creating emails to listen to AI songs that he made, that's a legitimate business to me. That's no different from making a YouTube sleep account to me. Right. Yeah. It, so, basically, yeah. And the people, um, the royalty companies denied his payout, basically, and whatnot. That's just hilarious because I feel like all the stories we hear about inflated numbers, um, they do it themselves, like the platforms do it themselves. So when a again, when the individual basis does it, and somebody wins who's not supposed to win, it's like you know what? Nope. There's conspiracy this week with oh, Sabrina, with Travis, Carpenter, and Travis. Travis, correct? Yeah. Oh, I haven't heard about that. Yeah. So um, Travis released days days before Rodeo, which was a mixtape, and <laughs> Sabrina she had her quote unquote debut album, and. Travis won. Oh, no, no, no. Sabrina won by like a thousand sales. But the crazy thing is, all year, people been doing like at the most, a top tier artist this year do like 40K in the first week. She did 361,000 and Travis did 360,000 for music that came out 10 years ago. What? So people are saying like the, there's something going on because how can Travis re-release a mixtape and sell three hundred and sixty thousand in a week? 
huh? And then nobody's doing numbers like that anymore. Yeah, nobody did numbers like that all year. I and I, to be honest with you, I don't think anybody. Big Sean I, came out. He did twenty four. YG came out. He did eight thousand. Eight. He did. Eight. I think the only person to even do numbers, numbers like that nowadays would either just be Drake. I don't Cole. even think Drake is doing numbers like that this year. I I don't I don't think, but he would be the only person I if I saw Drake numbers. Or like I, Taylor Swift. Taylor yeah, is but, the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't. Sure. Nobody else. I would be like, nah, that's. Or even I would say Beyonce. Yeah. Beyonce, yeah, but so. Nikki I, yeah, so too. That's true, Nikki. There's a I mean, Nikki did because hers did 200 in the first week. I didn't look up. Uh, what did Chris say? I'm not a Billie Eilish fan like that, but I think she sells a lot too. So yeah, she did. So that's another person. It's she still. It, it's just weird. It's just like it looks weird that he can't. <laughs> I saw one comment. I was like, damn, he should have stopped at nine. <laughs> he had to go for the ten. <laughs> 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 I was just like, bro, that we can't win. Even if you like find a way to like play with the system, they go lock your ass it's, up and say that like you're doing wire fraud. <laughs> How wire frauded if I got the money? Uh, that's crazy. That's I, I just don't see what he did wrong because he didn't get charged for making fake accounts or all that money laundering. Well, because of what? Because you found out my streams weren't real. So now I'm committing federal crime because you decided to investigate my streaming numbers? Yeah, that's, that's like, to me, that it just, it all seems legitimate. He was doing it out in the open. Like, he wasn't. Yeah, <laughs> just because he you found a loophole, I that doesn't honest, mean I should go to prison. Exactly. If anything, pay the man out and then tell him, hey, can't not, do this no more. Exactly, exactly. And then, however, Maybe. he. Exactly, but after you paid a man because he did it and he found the loophole, or like, look, come to some settlement, but suing him is crazy. Yeah, getting him locked up is crazy. crazy. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, time out. Like, Wait, what man. crime did he commit against humanity at this point? Yeah, like, what? there was hold on, how much time? He faced in sixty years. He fifty two years. That's old. what. It, that's what it is. Oh. I was like, I saw the number on here somewhere. It was sixty, bro. Come on, he's bro. He's facing sixty years. He's fifty two years old. Yes. Let yes. me find out. He's a black man. I'm gonna call Doctor Umar. <laughs> <laughs> let Hold let on. Umar find out. He a black man. Yeah, because that bro. that's crazy. All but because I got a, I got thirty. All because I got two hundred phones in my garage. You want to lock me up? <laughs> If it was a young person, they'd be trying to give him life. I feel like they get that man 60 years because he's 52. If it was That's a young life person, for him. That's if it was a young person, they would be like electric chair. Needle. This, this person's a danger to society. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. Him, whoever he is. Yeah. I, I, I just don't see... He did, bro. He, he committed a fun. crime with AI. Lock the AI up too, since you're there. You, you lock you, the AI up. That's just uh, that's yeah. just what comes with technology. You just live it in really it. Like, come on, bro. I'm just saying, if that's, that's the case, fun. like you know how many people they could lock up for the uh, lime wire. Well, I know somebody. I somebody in the comments like, well, what happened is because it takes away from the independent artist. Shut up. Man, we're talking no, about no, no. this right here. No, this is not, bro. If this y'all want to lock it. somebody up for AI, lock the people up who'll be turning them innocent pictures of chickens into moving animals. Because that'd be creeping me out. I don't oh, like it. Oh, they got some weird shit, bro. They I do. don't like it. Lock that up must... the people who was uh, telling people to commit check fraud and calling it a chase glitch. Oh, the chase shit, bro. Okay. Time out, time out, time out, time out. I don't have chase, but would you guys, honestly, I know it's hindsight, it? but would you guys no. do it if you did have one? No. no. Okay. Because right. it's not a glitch. It's literally, I'm putting in a check that's going to bounce and it's going to make my account negative. One thing I'll it. play about, <laughs> one thing I'll play about is like any kind of debt. I don't play about that. Okay. I was going to say, I don't mess around with no banks. So you couldn't get yeah, me. Yeah, I don't around. mess around with the IRS, taxes, banks, debt, money, stuff like that. Nope. <laughs> Nada. So uh, people people found out that if you deposit a check 
or if you apply through a loan through Chase, they up the money to you and you have like a really small window to take it out before they uh, run through their system and find out it's not good. That was, they they, they that was quote unquote the glitch. So niggas was getting like 60K, 50K, and <laughs> this ain't PPP time, yo. We gotta let that go. We're never Bruh. getting that again. One thing <laughs> about JP Morgan Chase, he's long dead and gone. That nigga is going to collect his money. You hear me? The yeah. banks are tied in with the government. There's no way you're gonna get away with this. Yeah, never. And even never. if you think you did, you really not gonna be looking over your shoulder every time. You got away with 50, 60K. You really not going to think at some point the mail is coming to you or somebody's going to come And then, like, like come on, bro. so it bounced back, right? They put your, so what I've been hearing is they put your account on hold for five days. After uh-huh. they put your account on hold, they close the account on you with the negative balance. So now they're actively going to try and collect money from you. Yeah. And they're going to garnish your check. You're done, bro. You're because the bank and the government done. is hand in hand. Hey, like, if you wanted to take out a sixty dollar loan, but now you have to pay back right for, <laughs> yeah. for the rest of your life forcibly. Yeah, bro. Do you? Do you? Knuckleheads, bro. Knuckleheads. Now, if it was like five hundred dollars and I did it, I'll be like, okay, cool, because I can make that back and just pay it back. But niggas is taking sixty out. racks. Hey, bro, it's a whole year salary. Yes. I think that seems you, you just have to be, I'm not saying dumb, but I think you just have to be slow to grasp naive. the concept. That's a corporate word for dumb. <laughs> yeah, you you have to have a level of naivety mm-hmm. to really believe that you could get away with something like that in the year 2024. Like, you're not walking into a bank and snatching a, a bushel of money right. and then riding off into the sunset with a mask on and they'll never catch you. <laughs> like you don't think that everything you do on your phone, like everything you do on any type of piece of technology is not tra- every time tra- every tra- time we end this pod episode, one of the topics we talked about will be an ad on my phone. I, t- I showed you guys when we were doing the jacket and literally the ad popped up on Instagram, the same Every fucking time. jacket, yeah. the brand. It was right there. Like, <laughs> yeah. Alexa, Alexa heard you commit them crimes. Yeah. Siri heard me. Sorry. Siri I held it know. down, though. <laughs> she, she'd be calling now, daddy and shit. Until, until the government win the case, but... <laughs> right. Right. Oh, that's that. That's, that's insane. Free him. Whoever, yes. whoever he is, free years. Yeah, bro. Let him, let him out, of, out of all the crimes, all the Venezuelan gangs running in Colorado, taking the city hostage, you want to charge this nigga with 60 years for having 200 phones in his garage and a solar panel. But who, I, so who's the one that has to pay him? Like Spotify? Well, it was the, well, it was, I, so he was using his, he was making his own music with AI. Right, and he was uploading it on Spotify, and then he had his bots play it over and over. It's the royal algorithm. So the royal. So when you have a song, you got publishing, and you got royalties, and you got uh, licensing deals. So the royalty company pays the artist based on the revenue that the song is making. So why can't he be independent? He is independent. Yeah, but he um, tried to a label or nothing. So he he registered all his songs personally. Correct. Like so an ASCAP or uh, here, bro? BMI. I, I never understand. It, I never honestly, bro, Shine, there's no crime. It's just they got. I, don't, I, don't, I think they're just mad that he got away with it, and they want to make an example. And if anything. There should be no jail time, and they should still break him off bread because he found a loophole. Oh, well. If Y'all anything, suck. they should hire this nigga and be like, show us so we can they get really these artists' work. revenues up. Well, that's what I'm saying, bro. Yeah, and who's to say, like, for real, like, nigga's not really doing this actually anyways right now. There's like, artists that legit. are legit doing this right now. They just mad that this nigga actually, like, didn't better yeah, nobody more. Nobody like, did it. That's crazy. I'm, yeah, come on. Because if he was signed to a music label, you think he would have got arrested? No. Oh, no. 
no, 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 not at all. Not at all. That's crazy. Pay that man. Shout out Pay to him, man. man. He found a loophole. He made 10 mil. They didn't want to try to take it back. Hey, that, man, that, man. In the midst of them taking it back, they're charging you with wire fraud because if they freeze your bank account and you send out money, technically by law, that's going to look like fraud because you don't have the money. But if they're get, freezing get my that bank man account, a good lawyer. Whatever, do. Yeah, man, that's some bullshit. I don't like <laughs> it. Look, look, look. It, said, it said, I'm just looking, it said um, his uh, songs generated as many as 661,440 streams per day. <laughs> that's hilarious. Hey. He was cooking. My guy was fucking cooking, little. bro. So what if, yeah. I, if I made a song and I paid my mom to just listen to it, like, you're committing you fraud. I've been numerous times. I don't, I'm going to jail? Uh, I guess. Now, they don't care about your little mom, but let your mom multiply into millions of listeners. That's what and, then, and then there's an issue. Then there's if, the issue. But they got, it, bot for, they got bot farms in China. Oh, for sure. They have crypto. You seen them big ass warehouses? They got GPUs running. It's just a warehouse full of computers running shit. Like, of course. Or the yeah. phone rooms, like you said, a garage full of fucking phones on stands and chargers of just playing shit. Yeah, just like, playing. That's, or, see, no, that's environmentally dangerous. I don't agree with that. <laughs> still, still, it's not illegal. It's not. Oh, he just, it it's just, he's just smart, bro. It's just. Tech, I think he just but. came up and got caught. Low key, so what some of the some of the people in the industry should get this nigga out of this little and, situation and, 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 exactly and pay the man, pay the man, pay the man. Um, yeah, they're probably mad because they found out how easy it is. Yeah, but but you like you can't lock me up just because you mad that I'm getting money and you not. I mean, like, that's crazy. That's, that's what they doing. I mean, they may do it to us all the time. <laughs> I really hate that. That's the government. Yeah, that's crazy. That's the same I, thing I, they'll do to uh, to um not to just like to make it weird or anything, but the same thing they do with like stocks and trading and shit. They'll lock somebody up for like insider trading. But don't they let like Martha one Stewart for they holding they it down. Stewart. Yeah, but like let a normal person do that shit. Life. And, and and Martha still would it, which she did some, but then she also get like half of it was like house arrest type shit. Like it, like she went to some let a regular, thing. yeah, let a, let a regular person. Oh, they would have come up max security. It's done. Oh, yeah. It's done, bro. You're done. You're cooked. Yeah, you're that was been crazy. Chilling with Bubba and them. <laughs> what you in here for? Beating the government and getting insider info and making getting money. information the day before the government. You know what's that crazy? They already know. That man on Catch Catch Me If You Can, he got Ooh. out and started helping them to like track people down that was committing fraud. And and Jordan Belfort, Jordan Belfort never paid for what he did for real. That man's going yeah. internationally speaking to college kids. Now he's getting paid to tell y'all about the scam. That right. That's what I'm saying. And they're going to lock this man up for. Yo, this is crazy. This is a travesty. So he should be oh, doing no. seminars instead of eating uh, bread and water for breakfast in prison. Yeah, he could even, if he's that smart, I, he. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens to the to the rest of the. You know, it's the same oh, thing. Sure. It's like it's like when kids, like tech kids, find out how to hack the IRS. They they hire them. They right, hired right. it. Exactly, exactly. You beat us at our own game. We're not safe. Yeah. Here's a job. Yeah. And then they're going to tell this man you committing money laundering. And why? Because I'm getting money? Hey, now he knows how to feel to be a black man. <laughs> we don't know if he is black or not. Did we look he at not. Him? Yeah, no, I'm, he to, I'm oh, just saying. Now he knows yeah. how to feel. Yeah, he do know how it is. Because if we get some money, they do that shit to us quick. That is a whole dis disenfranchisement because he really created a new lane. Like, there was nothing illegal going on about He cracked the code. That's what happened. He did it too good, bro. He found out that, and I'm just making this shit up. Like, if you play a song for five seconds and then press back again, it counts as a stream. Maybe that was the loophole. 
But then he just capitalized on it. He capitalized. It crazy. It. And then they said no. No said warning no. or nothing is crazy though. Like, 60 years when you're 52. <laughs> like, bro, come on, man. You should have got a slap on the wrist for that. Just give us half the money back. We'll let you keep half because you did get us. I'm saying. No, half the money back in the job. Man. They should be saying to him, how you want this? An annuity or what? <laughs> because you in didn't ones, commit the whole time. I want it in ones and stacks. It's crazy. That is crazy. I, man, I don't like that. I don't like it either. He cracked I it. saw it. I was like, bro, how was that? How was that even? It took them seven just, years was, for them to even catch up. So he was that's doing so it, like, uninspiring. Right, right. That makes me Got not want to figure out nothing else for the rest of my life and fear that. <laughs> like, I was just talking to somebody about how, like, if you dig in your backyard and find, like, a diamond, your diamond. What? It's the nah, it's diamond. mine. It's the government's diamond. They gonna take. They go to the black market. They gotta take this shit in blue. You will have to. Yep, you will have to go to the black market. Find somebody who know how to get you to the black market. We all got one friend that can get us into some shit. 